Hey, how's it going? Amite here, and today I will be doing another episode of my Road to Endgame in Maple Story. Today we are going to be doing boss runs. Now, before we do, I have a question. Not that anyone would answer it in here. Um, would you prefer post-game uh, commentary or commentary during my when I actually play? Because the way I'm formatting these episodes right now is that I'm taking all the footage and then um, vo doing a voiceover so that I actually can uh, optimize the video time so you don't have to watch all of it. Uh, anyways, I'll try to figure it out, but today I'm going to show you my daily boss runs and how, how to make a few mil each day. So as of right now, you're watching me getting ready for Hilla. Um, I do Hilla, Zakum, and Golux, but I do Golux differently from everyone else. I will explain it when we get there, but right now I'm do basically doing a voiceover after all my uh, boss runs. So if you want like live commentary, please let me know. I'll try and make it interesting, but I don't think I'm entertaining at all. I just wanted to record my progress so I could make myself feel good inside. <laughs> um, no, but seriously, I really want to get to uh, end game and st start being able to run the chaos bosses, uh, hard Golux, go maybe even hell Golux. But uh, we gotta. W I'm working there, so basically, uh, I do Hilla twice, Zakum twice, and Golux all three times. Uh, right now you're watching my first Galux run, and it's pretty standard stuff, so I'm just going to skip ahead to when she dies. So at Hilla's, I just pick up everything she drops, and I extract all the necro weapons for superior crystals. that uh, They sell for about 1.5 to 2.5 mil in Scania. So it's, it makes me quite a bit of money, but uh, I'm not factoring this in into my equation at the moment because it, it is determined by whether or not I actually sell the item. And this, I usually just stockpile superior crystals at the, and uh, sell them all at once afterwards, so I don't count it. Anyway, so I just do two runs of that, and then I go to Zaku, do the same thing with pots, and it makes the total will make me around uh, let me check around two and a half mil and if you factor in the superior item crystals maybe around like uh, four to six mil a day it's not much but it's something and I'm sure once I actually start scrolling my equips that I got as you saw from uh, last episode my CRAs and the uh, reinforced Golux equips uh, then I'll start to be able to do much more, but for now I guess I have to take it slowly. Now for when I do Golux, I usually just kill his two shoulders three times because my dam my range is good enough to kill uh, easy mode Zaku, but the problem with it is, which is why I don't do the abs as well, is because the minute I get locked in, I get screwed, and on top of that I actually lose percent XP in Golux. And I'm level 200, so the XP d comes really slow. And since I don't have the range to train at a second drill hall or ha anywhere, that's why dying to me is like much more important than, say, someone else. That's why, so while I actually have XP dur during my level, I won't be attacking the ab or trying to do easy mode Golux. Is because I'm trying to get to level 201 or just the next level in general, if uh, for future reference. But yeah, it's what I have to do in order to... Well, okay, well, yeah. Irony. Anyways, but as you can see, my damage just goes straight down the drain, and I don't have, like, a minute to even rest. To Because, like, if I don't, during the abs or the head, uh, if I don't, like, kill the things on the side and keep dodging the roots in, root in places, uh, then I just die again, which makes it very redundant and pointless to me. That's why I stopped doing uh, the head and abs. But sometimes I usually get lucky 
and I have a few good friends that are willing to help me uh, run Golux. I have a uh, Tublub, shout out to the Cal, Moo. Uh, he brings me to hard Golux, and then I had someone else who said uh, he or she would bring me to normal Golux every day, but t today at the time of this recording, she or he wasn't there, so I just did it by myself. Uh, yeah, so if we just skip over to the next piece of footage, I'll show you how much I actually make per run, minus the superior crystals. Um, in this clip, I'm ac I actually sold the items I got from yesterday because I forgot to do it prior to recording this. But uh, as you can see, I'm just earning like a couple hundred thousand each time I sell something, and then the Sunset Dews get me around like 1.2, 1.3 mil each. And from that clip, I got 2. Point something mil, so it's not bad for something you get to do daily. Uh, within a week you already get 4 mil and on top of that the superior crystals can get me quite a bit as well but anyways that's all I have to show you for today I'm sorry it's not as exciting I'm still trying to figure out how uh, I'm tr going to run these episodes but uh, I hope you have a good time and see ya <laughs>